I've been, been a designer ever since school, and since retiring, I've been doing a lot more art and not as much design, and making stuff. I made stuff as early as kindergarten when I had a shop that my grandfather had, and I still do. So making stuff. And, and speaking of stuff, that would be the title of this show, you know, Little Stuff. I've had a long time interest in design, drawing, sculpture, structure, especially structure. Uh, probably the result of designing and building hundreds of model airplanes and ships as a kid and sailboats as an adult. I've been teaching design and drawing for 40 years at Binghamton University and recently I've been doing drawings in small sculpture, expressing a lifetime interest in the natural world and more recently in digital imaging. All of my pieces of art express something about me, and I don't know what that means completely, but I have a, uh, a gut feeling that it means something to me. If I could express it in words, I'd have been in the English department. One of the things I always told students is that all of the art forms are the same. You take a design class and you're going to be a better dancer, or take an architecture class and it'll help in poetry. It's uh, all of the arts are the same. We use the same words to describe them, theme and variation, rhythm, harmony, the same words, and that's not an accident.